There was a Trump aide who made an excuse for why Donald Trump canceled a particular interview, and the aide said that he was exhausted. And this became a major talking point for the Kamala Harris campaign and for the news media. And Donald Trump does show signs of exhaustion at times, but overall, the guy has an incredible level of vitality for someone who is 78 years of age. Now that uh, Joe Biden is no longer in the race and Donald Trump is the oldest candidate in the race, then suddenly the age of the candidate and his mental capacities are a key concern for the news media. So they covered up for Joe Biden's senility for years. Now they're putting the focus on Donald Trump. This stray remark that Donald Trump is exhausted, it played into the media focus that Donald Trump is unfit for office, and they're looking for all sorts of, of different examples, hoping to find one that will land with swing voters on why Donald Trump is unfit for office. And the latest explanation is that he's simply too tired. He's just too exhausted to campaign adequately, and this shows that he will be un unfit for office. Kamala Harris has pivoted back to Joe Biden's primary attack that uh, Donald Trump was unfit for office. That was the primary reason that Joe Biden said people should reelect him in 2024. Now, Kamala Harris's message is very similar to Joe Biden's message, but the messenger is different. And so sometimes you can have an identical message, and when it's delivered by one person, it's not going to land. But when it's delivered by a different messenger, it will land.